today's lecture we will discuss about the launching method for the segmental bridges if we talk about the launching method for the segmental bridges then these launching method are broadly classified into five major categories first is balanced cantilever method of launching the second is precast span by span erection or launching method the third is incremental launching method the fourth is mss is movable scaffolding system okay and the last one is heavy lifting okay now in this lecture we will discuss about uh, in brief the balance cantilever method of launching now this balance cantilever method of launching is just simple if you from the name it is clear suppose this is the pier you have this is the pier okay you have casted some pier uh, now either you can put you can directly cast the segment over the pier okay you can directly cast the segment over the pier or you can just have it the this uh, element casted at the casting yard and uh, do the erection using the crane now in this uh, uh, basically this balance cantilever method what we does we basically start uh, doing the uh, segmental joining at the both side at the both side okay and similarly at the other pier it is also going in the same fashion and at the one point they both and the mid they get meet up and the span is completed okay this is simple basic fund of balance cantilever so in this video we will discuss it in detail what exactly it is from the balance cantilever the name is clear the balance cantilever this balance cantilever method of uh, this uh, launching is generally uh, used where the span is of irregular length suppose there is this one span this is a viaduct over there okay this is the viaduct okay this span length is basically 35 meter this is 40 meter okay this is 32 meter okay if there is such cases where the span length is irregular we generally go for this balance cantilever method okay and this balance cantilever method can be used for the span uh, ranging from 50 meter basically 15 meter to 50 meter to 250 meters okay for these span ranging from 50 meter to 250 meter you can use this balance cantilever method and it is generally used at the place uh, where uh, uh, the span length varies as well as the project sites are congested or there is some rough and water terrain basically there is such some like marine project is there and uh, it is like this uh, the viaduct have to cross over some railway span rail uh, rail crossing or something sort of or it is uh, like a, there is some environmental sensitive area then you have to go for the balance cantilever okay the main thing is that you must remember the 50 meter to 250 meter span length you can easily do the erection over this now this balance cantilever method can be of <coughs> can be done in two ways first is the cast in situ uh, in cast in situ we will discuss in detail one is the cast in situ and there is the precast cast in situ means that we are doing the casting at the site itself okay what we are doing we are doing the casting at the site itself so we have we must have form work at the site and precast means that the element is being casted at some casting yard from casting yard we will transfer this element to the site and will feed and will feed to the uh, this bridge or the span for the erection purposes basically okay that there is transportation involved from casting yard to the site okay in this casting say to basically the environmental control you can't control the environment as much but in the casting yard, if it is generally casted the casting yard, you can control the environment so you can have the very good surface finish very good quality product at the casting yard generally nowadays casting say to is avoided generally precast is done okay still we will understand uh, what basically this balance cantilever method the approach is same you have one pier at this side you have other pier at the other side you just start joining and it will at the one point they will both the end now this cast in situ what happen basically we have one pier with us okay this is pier with us so on the pier what we does pier segment is being casted over the pier okay over the pier we will cast pier segment and how this pier segment is because with the help of the forms form work we will use and we will cast the pier segment now this uh, casted pier segment will be used as a erection platform okay where we will install the form work on both the sides suppose uh, this is uh, mm, suppose uh, this is the pier okay in this pier we have 
कास्टिव दिस पी एस सेगमेंट ओके नाउ ऑन दिस कास्टिव पी एस सेगमेंट वी विल इंस्टॉल द फॉर्म वर्क ऑन बोथ द साइड ओके लाइक दिस ओके दो दिस फॉर्म ट्रेवल दिस फॉर्म वर्क विल ट्रेवल अलॉन्ग बोथ द डायरेक्शन ओके इन दिस सेगमेंट पी एस सेगमेंट वी हैव इंस्टॉल्ड ऑन बोथ साइड द फॉर्म वर्क बेसिकली ओके इट इज लाइक दिस तो नाउ दिस फॉर्म वर्क विल हैव सॉफिट वेव एंड डेक्स सेटरिंग ओवर दे वंस वी हैव डन बोथ साइड सॉफिट वेव एंड डेक्स सेटरिंग ओवर ए सर्टेन लेंथ तो वॉट वी डज वी बेसिकली स्टार्ट डूइंग कंक्रीटिंग एंड वंस द कंक्रीटिंग इज डन एंड दे विल स्टिच इट अप तो इन दिस मैनर इट विल कीप ऑन मूविंग बोथ साइड सिमिलरली फ्रॉम द अदर साइड द अदर स्पेन इज ऑल्सो मूविंग लाइक दिस एट वन पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम दीज बोथ विल मीट अप दीज फॉर्म वर्क दे विल बी स्टिच अप एंड द होल दिस स्पेन विल बी कंप्लीटेड तो दिस इज बेसिकली द सिंपल फंडा ओवर देयर ओके हेयर द मेन रोल इज ऑफ द फॉर्म वर्क वी हैव टू ट्रेवल द फॉर्म वर्क ओके एंड एट द मिड at the mid of the span uh, one from the one pier there is another form work is coming from the other pier they are just basically joined up okay the stitching beam is there the stitching is will done closure stitch form work is there where both the uh, this will be joined up so it is simple okay so basically in this uh, segment uh, basically agar hum dekhte hain production date if you talk about the segmental production date so in the in basically one segment in 5 days इसमें क्या होता है वी बेसिकली डू सेगमेंट वन सेगमेंट इन फाइव डेज ओके दिस इज जनली द प्रोडक्शन डेट ऑफ दिस एंड दिस सेगमेंट द दैट दिस सेगमेंट दैट वी कास्ट जनली ऑफ थ्री मीटर टू फाइव मीटर थ्री मीटर टू फाइव मीटर दिस इज द बेसिक फंड ऑफ दिस कास्ट इन से टू दिस बैलेंस कैंटीलीवर मैथड नाउ दी अनदर इज बेसिकली प्री कास्ट इन प्री कास्ट वॉट बेसिकली डज इन प्री कास्ट द फर्स्ट एलिमेंट इफ यू क्लोजली लुक दिस दिस इज द पीयर ओवर देयर ओके this is the pier with the help of crane we first erected the first span okay uh, this first element first pier element okay first pier element okay we have erected the first pier element on this first pier element we have installed hanger beams on these hanger beam we have basically attached there is a railing system over there we have attached the lifting frames we have attached the lifting frames they they basically uh, they what basically does there is some main beam over there okay there is cross beam over there main beam is there there is cross beam is over there on this main beam and cross beam there is one winch system is being uh, there okay the what this winch system does this winch system will the this segment will be feed in uh, feed uh, at the bottom side this segment will be feed at the bottom side the winch will uh, the winch will be having a spreader beam this spreader beam will fix into the segment through the macloy bar and it will get fixed it to them and this uh, lifting setup will lift it up the segment okay when this lifting setup is being with the cement then dry match is being done uh, then gluing is being done okay the stressing platform is also there so stressing is also done so it's keep on like this uh, from this side it like this from the other side it is also like this so at the one point they both joined up okay so in this way this balance cantilever is being done in the balance cantilever method so if we go per the there is two segment you can join per shift okay in the casting setu what one segment in basically 5 days you are making the form work you are doing the concrete so one segment take 5 days but in this pre cast uh, it takes around two pair in a shift you can basically do the um, two segments erection basically if this is the normally 12 segments to 14 segments or even depending upon the span length uh, the segments are there 3 meter to 5 meter generally segments are of uh, they have to 5 meter 12 14 15 depends upon the how long is the span is okay so this uh, typical erection cycle for this pre cast erection using the balance cantilever is you can do the two pair two segments pair in a single shift if there is a six element a 12 element is there to six days you can complete the span if 14 elements uh, there to seven days you can complete the span here if, if the single element is being uh, it is casted in five days okay so 12 five it will take a too much time okay if 12 element is there so it will take too much time okay so this is the basic funda so this is basically the basic fund of the balance cantilever system hope you like this video and uh, in the next lecture we will discuss about the precast span by span and uh, in this precast span by span and incremental launching i will discuss the topic lg launching gantry in detail i will share you the videos how the lg works i will share you all the details to so keep subscribing the channel keep supporting the channel